<laughs> hey guys, <laughs> look at this. Come here, come here. Look, look at this. Look, come, come here. Yeah, come, come, come on, come on. See, see these, see these. Watch this. Watch. Come on, come, come on. All right. So if you look right here, I've been testing out these transfers, and they're all amazing. And I want to show you just how amazing they are by pressing one and getting you to see for yourself just how easy it is, how they press, and um, show you guys how like uh, similar this is to something that you might have seen already. All right, so I'm gonna take this transfer right here, and I'm gonna put it right here, and I'm gonna get a cover sheet, cover it up. I'm going to press it, 15 seconds, only 270 degrees, 15 seconds. Watch this, watch this. You're gonna be impressed, watch this. Four, three, two, one. Bam, bam. Grab the corner, bam. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Now, press it again. Couple more seconds. Guys, hot peel is in order. Hot, come on. Hot, <laughs> hot peel is in full effect, guys. Look, hot peel is in full effect, guys. AllenAway.com. Look at that. Let's do it one more time. Let's, let's, let's do it again. All right, this time we're going to put it right here. This time we are going to put it on the other side. Right here, okay? Straighten it out. We're going to put this big one right here. I'll put it in, cover sheet, press it, 15 seconds, 270 degrees, ooh, feet sees, feet sees, walking around the studio with my feet sees, five, four, three, two, one, pop up, make sure you get yourself a pop up, ooh, baby, not tonight, oh my gosh, nothing. Final press. Guys, guys, allenaway.com. Get yourself some heat transfer presses. December 7th, like you just All right, Dub Nation, Dub Nation. I want you guys to, 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 to take a moment to listen to what I have to say right now. Take a moment to listen to what I have to say right now, guys. Um, Right now, the space that we are in has never been more exciting and it's still gonna become more and more exciting. All right, I know the economy's messed up. I know funds are tight. I know everything is tight for everybody right now, but we are in some amazing times right now because of all the resources we have available to us, guys. In the comment section, do you understand what I'm saying, guys? We got embroidery machines available for purchase. We got options to purchase them. We have white toner transfer printers available to us. We have opportunities and different ways to purchase those. We have DTF machines and different ones to choose from. We have different heat presses. We have different vinyl cutters. We got the exciting Caesar cutter. We got the iColor 760 exciting times and out of every single thing hmm I would say now I can advise you guys of what you really need in order to be a one-stop print shop all right you guys ready for this all right you guys ready you got you guys ready all right so most of you guys already have a sublimation printer all right so you need a sublimation printer at least 16 by 20 to start. At least a big one to start, right? You need that Sawgrass SG-1000, you need that. So if you don't have that, use my Heat Transfer House affiliate link down in the description below. Just go ahead and get that, because you need that, right? All right, now eventually you want to graduate and you want to get a large format sublimation printer, but you know, you got to work your way up to that thing right there. You always gotta work your way up. Start small and work your way up and then, you know, then sell this old stuff and pay it forward. You know, I'm giving them a little hookup, giving them a little discount or whatever so they can get in there. Anyway, so 
and you need an embroidery machine and a DTF printer. And, and wait, 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 you don't actually even really need the DTF printer if you got people like me that got the big boy right there. Let me tell you guys something. There is no reason that you can't fulfill any job right now because with, between embroidery and DTF at all of your disposal, the possibility is endless. The earning potential is endless. You got your heat press already. And I just feel so empowered that I'm able to make these videos and help you guys come to this realization. And I'm here to offer you my DTF services so that you don't have to go out and spend almost $19,000 on this printer. But if you want to spend $19,000 and get your own, I encourage you to do so. This is better than purchasing a car. I encourage you to do so because the car is not going to give you a return every month. This is just like that. The car is not going to give you a return. And that is right. So I encourage you if you have the means to do so to do so. But if you don't go ahead, use my services and 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 work your way up or even get the small DCF printer and work your way up. Shout out to AA Print Supply. Shout out to Racoma. Shout out to Heat Trans Warehouse. Shout out to um, Heat Press Nation. Shout out to uh, Uninet. Shout out to Garment Printer Inc. Man, I know. Shout out to Vexels. Oh my gosh, guys! Amazing times right now. In the comments down below, has there been a more exciting times in garment decorating industry than right now? The answer is no. Let me answer for don't don't even don't even type in the comments. I'll answer for you. The answer is no. There's never been a more exciting time. Um, everybody's trying to figure out DTF. This is the way to go with the big one. These are the way to go with the big embroidery machines. There's no order. There's nothing that you can't do. Once you got some embroidery machines and some transfers, what can't you do? What can't you do? Get a sublimation printer, get a sewing machine. There's no order you can't really fill. Think about that. So now the question is, out of all these machines, if I had to choose one machine, which one would I choose out of all these machines? If I had to choose one and my business would just be made out of one machine, comprised out of one machine, which machine would I choose, guys? I think you guys already know the answer to this question, but I would definitely choose as of right now, because this could possibly change my mind, but as of right now, I would definitely choose embroidery, but this machine right here is a heavy contender, heavy contender. I'll tell you why it's a heavy contender and why I like the idea of this so much, because the reason why I like the idea of it, the main reason why I like the idea of it is because I, with this machine, not only am I able to help money, not, not help money, but with this machine right here, not only am I able to make money, but I think that this machine right here is capable of not only helping me make money, but it's also capable of helping whoever I sell the transfers to, to make money better than the embroidery machines. Does that make sense, guys? So you can buy this for 18 grand, right? And you have a full-fledged business. You can make, you can get take orders, take orders. In order for you to accomplish the same thing with embroidery, you need a bunch of different heads. See what I'm saying? So in order for you to pump out volume with embroidery, you need a bunch of heads. In order, you, in order for you to pump out volume with DTF, you only need one big DTF. So the possibilities of not only you making this very, very profitable is up here faster than there because with one machine, one shirt, one hat, you know, to pump out volume, you need several and you need a lot of space for several machines. This, you still need a lot of space, 
but not as much as you do for one, two, three, four, five, six. I'd say 12 heads will probably be ideal for embroidery. All right, my goal is 10. Right now I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six, four short. So my goal is 10 industrial Rakoma heads and that's all I really want. That's all I want for right now, for right now. All right, so my goal is 10 heads. This right here, this was the goal. This was the goal right here. I got, the, this is the goal for this. So I can, so see the, see the possibilities? Just, just think about that, guys. Just think about that. Still love embroidery because there's nothing like it. There's nothing like the feel. There's nothing like, you know, people will pay for embroidery. People, will, even if you embroider on a bad, on a whack, on a horrible garment, people will pay top dollar for embroidery. It just is what it is. It's hard to get people to pay for a shirt, a printed shirt, right? Okay, maybe it's not harder. Maybe, maybe what I'm trying to say is it's easier to sell something embroidered and get more money than it is to sell a printed shirt with the same design on it, right? Because embroidery is just perceived higher and it's in the garment, right? So it's just, it's just a higher value. So, um... It's up in the air, guys. This does have a learning curve to it, does have a learning curve. The big ones do have learning curves to it, but the learning curve is a lot less than embroidery. You gotta learn the software, learn how to line up the white ink with the, with the color ink, but after you get that, get that down packed, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys. Go ahead, go ahead on over to allenaway.com, order your DTF transfers right now. I'm so excited and I'm so honored and privileged to be able to offer you guys transfers to purchase on my website because I really feel like I'm helping you because you can start making money selling t-shirts with my DTF transfers. And I'm selling them at a, a low price, a reasonable price. So I really feel like I'm helping you while you help me. That's the thing. With embroidery, I can't go so low on the price because embroidery takes time, right? And my time is valuable. My time is valuable over here too, but the machine is like set it and forget it. So I can press, you know, I can put 50 prints to print and I can walk away. So I can afford to charge you lower because the machine is pretty much doing the work itself. Embroidery, the machine is doing the work itself. But as you know, like right now, I think I got to change. Yep. Right now I got to change a bobbin. So it's a little bit different. Embroidery is a little bit more, a little bit more work, right? But um, overall, I'd say embroidery is still my favorite as of right now. But this is probably going to be my favorite money-making wise, right? But everything, I, I like the art of embroidery. But like I said, this is probably capable of making more money faster. This standalone one machine right here to compete. Embroidery would have to, you have to have more heads and you have to do a whole lot more physical labor to, to get the machines to pump out um, the volume that it takes to make the equivalent money that you would than you would with this. That's my, that's my opinion. I don't know. I don't know. I could be wrong. I don't know. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you see how my transfers peel. Um, as soon as it pops up, you want to grab the edge, get low and just peel it fast comes right off hot peel you see that i wasn't able to do that with my other with my other transfers but now guys we're good to go thank you so much for watching love you guys exciting times talk to you guys in the next video peace